say that it takes right now. Mm-hmm. It's going good. Would you let me say? Hi, my name is Bernard Stunder. I am 13 years old and the car you see in the background over here, that is my car. Her name is Daisy. We've had her for about four years now and she's a really special car to me. The reason she's so special to me is because she's a different car, you know, like not a car you're going to see every single day. This is something that me and my father built in our garage a few a few years ago and it's just our little project we're still working on it it's still gonna have so many different changes my hobbies are longboarding I like art and you'll see that it's actually incorporated on my car, uh, it's on the hood lining of the car. This car has brought me and my dad much more closer together and has strengthened our relationship because it gives us time to spend together in our garage and like do different kinds of stuff to the car, just mess around, see what we can do, mess around with spotlights and everything, it's, it's really fun. Good day guys and girls, uh, my name is Bernard Stander. I uh, started with air-cooled cars about 30 years ago. My first car was a Fiat 500. Uh, after that I've had various other air-cooled cars uh, including Beetles, buses, Type 3s and uh, I've always enjoyed them. At the moment we have this uh, 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 67 Beetle, her name's Daisy, actually belongs to my son and uh, we've been working on it for about four to five years on and off, uh, actually driving the car every single day. Uh, we enjoyed it so much that I actually didn't bother uh, getting any other vehicle to drive with daily. Uh, only recently we acquired another vehicle and uh, we're enjoying days in now on weekends. When we bought Daisy, uh, which was uh, actually a very, very standard looking Beetle, uh, like I said, she's a 67. And uh, when I got it, I was basically busy buying, fixing up and selling, you know, as a hobby, you know, I enjoyed it. But when I got this car, I decided that I wanted to keep it. So I said to my son, look, I'm giving you this car. He uh, obviously rightfully claimed it his by uh, uh, coloring in and drawing all kinds of pictures and things inside the car and the roof lining which obviously we love uh, and I'll never get rid of um, then afterwards you know it was a, a matter of driving the car and enjoying it so that's why we kept it and we never really worried about uh, like I said buying another car was was out of the option because we were driving it every single day and we, we, we were enjoying it another another choice that was that was between me and my dad, but it was more on my side because I kind of complained to him to put it back, was the rusted bonnet with the bullets on the front because that used to be on a previous car that we had that my father sold. And uh, uh, the guy didn't want the bonnet because he thought it looked ugly with the car and everything. So he just gave it back to us. And then we decided why not put it on this car. I mean, most of the colors on it perfectly match it. Uh, we're running 205-65-15s at the back and 145-65s in the front. Obviously very very thin tyres in the front so that it can turn inside the, the wheel arches. We also had uh, the front suspension dropped, the, the rear suspension dropped and uh, the interior was done by Tariq Musa. Um, did a very very nice job, there's almost no wear on the seats. Uh, after two and a half years and uh, the rear seats are still brand new. Not really because nobody's sitting on it, but uh, we're looking after it. Um, we had the engine done up uh, about two years ago. Uh, she's now running at 1.7 liters, uh, normal carburetor, performance exhaust on and obviously uh, electronic ignition uh, from GTEC. 
it works very very well um, also the car starts first time always uh, 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 driving driving it daily and, and that always you know makes makes people think uh, you know is there another engine in the car uh, you know is the engine modified um, no the engine's not modified the engine is a little bit bigger in CC but uh, it's the original engine that the car came out with uh, just a little bit tweaked the actual group we belong to is Air Cooled Hooligans and we obviously are part of Air Cooled Hooligans South Africa chapter. We, uh, we've been a part of this group for five years. Um, we really enjoy uh, uh, driving an air cooled car. We enjoy going out for breakfast runs, going out to, do, to support charities. We do a lot of charity work uh, uh, through Air Cooled Hooligans and uh, basically end of the year we do a Christmas drive which is always successful and uh, we have very good participation in that. If you want more information about air-cooled hooligans, specifically if you're interested in air-cooled cars, uh, go to the page air-cooled hooligans South African chapter and check them out, go follow them and everything. And if you want more information about my car Daisy specifically, uh, go follow Life of Daisy on Facebook. This is Bernard Stunder Jr's ride. Uh, this is his ride, he likes it. Some people may not like this a hobby, some people may not like these cars, but we like it, he likes it, we enjoy it, so uh, that's why we do it. If, if you see us at car shows, please come and say how's it, please come and have a nice look at the car. Closer look, uh, you will enjoy it. And uh, once again, thank you for watching.